Okay, let's continue our story with what happened to Edith Finch. We just finished discovering Calvin. Mom said Grandpa Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the But that's again. a lie. What kind of a house is this? The passages were a pretty tight fit. They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. Growing up, I always thought of Barbara as a child star. Uh, wasn't she? Everyone in this family is a participant. Of all the stories people wrote about Barbara's death, I'm surprised Edie saved this ah, one. Ah, yeah, this is after her there. It's Barbara's father, Sven. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency room. Really? So Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother, Walter. Her convention comeback was cancelled. <laughs> okay, I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing terror. What if I tried... A gang of hoodlums and Halloween masks have been terrorizing Orca's Island tonight. Police are urging residents to... Is that enough? That came from the basement. You're right. Also, I loved your delivery on that. Why is your basement door locked? Because my dad likes making puzzles and Oh, it's the dad puzzles. made this. There's a key hidden in the music box. The secret is to keep winding and winding until finally the key Oh! Puzzle. Thanks, babe. That's good to know. I'll be back in a sec. The gang's leader is the infamous Hookman Killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten um, years ago. <laughs> what? The old fridge rattled and grew Fridge? It, I, did I die because of a fridge? Oh dear! Oh no, it's our stupid boyfriend. We should have hit him hard. Ah, oh, yeah, we did. Haha, <laughs> yes. Rick? <laughs> I hate jokes. Barb, relax. What happened to Walter? Walter? What's going on up there? Ah! Up. But if this is a trick, you're dead, Walter. How old was Walter when this was happening? But yet again, who's ah Walter? Okay, Walter lived long. Longer than the sister for sure, so okay, okay. What the hell is this? I came in like a wrecking ball. What? Why is this? <laughs> what is this? Oh, is it chair? <laughs> Orcas Island police describe the man as six feet tall with a steel hook for a hand. Residents are urged to lock all doors and windows and notify the police of any suspicious activity. I returned, saw the hook man, and. <laughs> Home Alone, Halloween edition. He wasn't moving, but she sensed the story. I don't think one can die over yet. that easily. Oh yeah, of course. Had vanished. I'm gonna moonwalk. Surprise! Bravo! You were wonderful. Are you retarded people? Surprise her. For Barbara, it was a dream come true. Then she saw what kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. What was about to happen? Going to be famous. And little Walter? Hiding under his bed the whole time. What? Edie told me all Barbara wanted was to be remembered. As absurd as that comic was, maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. Really? And why the hell do we have a cake? She died in six days. Hold it. Hello. Hold it. It turned out she was Why? I Walter. am not surprised. I remember asking Mom once about where Walter had gone. She said after Barbara died, he got as far away as Walter he could. is the one that lived longer. If there's a pattern in all these stories, I think it's that none of us has gotten very far. You mean going away from the family or not living longer? Because I will vote for the second one. But can somebody explain me why Walter was living in a basement like this? Goodbye, everyone. I can't believe I've been down here for 30 years. 30 years? Why? <laughs> Having a schedule, living for today. 
I always expect I, I you to be dead. I thought quarantine well. was bad. I'm done waiting. I have to leave. Well, I still can. Hold the door, Walter. You're not that PTSD. Come on. I know it's out there. What's it? Somewhere. Whatever killed Barbara and Molly. Huh. Okay, that's deeper than what I thought. And Calvin. But I need to stop living the same day. Even if it kills me, whatever's out there, I want you to know I'm ready for it. I don't think you're ready for anything. I'm going to appreciate all of it, especially the food. I don't mind if I only have a year left. Or a month. Or a single week. I'd be happy. I hope it's longer than day. that. I can already imagine the sun. Are you fucking kidding me? Don't waste to die. So many don't waste to die. Really? I died when I was six. I can't Are you fucking kidding me? me? Down here. Maybe we believed so much in a family curse. We made it real. Why there are chairs on trees? The pet cemetery may be more uncomfortable than the human one. Derpy, lurpy, furpy, chirpy, burpy, derpy, derpy, junior. Really? If she told me there was going to be so much climbing, I never would have come when I was 22 weeks pregnant. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, no. Now I'm kind of pretty sure we're going to die. Instead of hiding from death, Sam seemed to go out of his way to meet it. Ooh, another selfie lover! Dawn, I promise, you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are gonna last a lifetime. Mm. I will never forget this weekend, Dad. Okay, this is That's our mother. That's the spirit side. Hmm. Hi, Dad. Hey. <laughs> That's a keeper. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of you. Bar to Instagram! Do I have to do this? Dawn, you don't have to do anything. But if you want to survive, you'll need to be strong. Whenever you're ready. Where is it? What are we trying to shoot? Oh. One more time, I'm retarded. Great shot, Don! Are we gonna take picture of this one as well? I'm proud Don, of you, Don. Don is crying! Always remember I that, just wanna go okay? ahead and hug Don. That's all I want. He's... <laughs> We're not aware that she's Dad, crying. Dad, it's twitching. I think That's it's... That's totally so normal, Don. Just focus on the camera. Try not to think about- Dad! Oh! What? Are you fucking kidding me? This game is bullshit. Don't waste to die. So many don't waste to die. Of all these stories, that's the one I wish most that my mom had told me. If I was your mother, why would I tell you the story that my dad died in front of me? What kind of a fucked up game is this? Dear Kay, do you remember the way Gregory used to laugh when he thought he was alone? Like something funny was happening, but only he could see it. Got to hand over Gregory, it's time to- Hi Kay, and the pink bathroom. Hold on, sweetie. Come on, I want to get it, yes! Oh, I got an achievement! Ah, okay, so this wasn't what this mission was about. I really thought when I get the letters, this will be done. I'm gonna be drowned. I think I'm trying to drown myself. Damn it. Yeah. Hold on, I don't want Gregory to hear this. I'm one year old. It's better if you're around me than me hearing shit. Ah, yeah, we want more water. Oh, God. Another very dark death. I mean, there's no happy thing in this game. This game is just page after page after page of sadness. Amazing. A poem for Gus, who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Our father never hit us kids, at least not very hard. Before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. Oh yeah, that's not a joke to be made next to your father. I tried to talk him out of it, but though he'd never met her, 
We don't need a stepmom were the words that I now pronounce you husband and Oh, we don't need a stepmom. And that explains why there were chairs in the trees. And we are still not getting in, I mean. Dark she never an upsetting Gus, story. Mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. Dom, sweep, trash, Gus, mop, mow yard, Greg, be a baby. <laughs> she spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. My mom moved to India a week after graduation. Oh, okay, got so a job we were away English. from this. Lewis was For a born while. a year later. When my dad died, I don't think mom knew where else to go. The house had to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. Yeah, the house didn't need to get bigger, actually, but that's what Edie likes. The beginning of the end was Milton's 10th birthday, when Edie gave him a castle. What do you mean, castle? After Milton disappeared, the only thing he left behind was a room full of paintings. Was that paintings? I thought it was blood. Milton Finch in The Magic Paintbrush. Can I? Hey. We don't know what happened to him, so it just was... I was four when Milton disappeared. Everyone always told me to stay out of Lewis's room. Except Lewis. What? <laughs> ah, yeah. Makes sense. <laughs> Makes sense. Lewis and I spent a lot of time playing games together, but he was surprisingly bad at them. Because probably he, he was high AF. As I see it, the trouble began in January, shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. Newly sober, I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. His mind began to... What? His mind began to what? Wander. Ah. Oh! I'm... I'm a wizard, Harry! He built the city up slowly. Birth the city of empire? Wololo. I cannot hold the fish anymore because my imagination is getting too big. <laughs> yeah, look at the way they wave. Look at the chubby ones. He started drifting away from our reality. That's a nice metaphor. What happened to my hand? What is happening to my hand? Hello. Hello, can I wave back to you? No, I, I need to deal with my fish. In his own eyes, he'd become something greater than a king. What did we become? Fish king! But the real Lewis was not the one chopping salmon, but the one climbing the steps of a golden palace. Oh, Inception! <laughs> what are you doing, Lewis? Um, that's not how you do the fish, Lewis. Oh, okay. What do we do? We go up? I still thought I could save him. <laughs> Look at them! My goodness, they're adorable. It's gonna it's be guillotine, isn't it? Holding his crown. Yep, that's a guillotine. And down his head. I don't want to. I don't even. Oh God! What are you gonna draw My there? Was a really guillotine? Cool. I wish you could have met him. Oh, wait, you're preparing this for your baby? On the way back from Lewis's funeral, my mom told me to start packing. My mom ended up Why? leaving everything exactly. behind. Exactly, that's what I want to know since the beginning. That whole last day, Edie just watched us pack and didn't say a word. Until supper, when she raised her glass and said, To our final night together, and all our final nights apart. Grandma, you know what I said about alcohol. Some of your medications are very Edith, specific. I left a present for you in the hallway. Why don't you go open it? When my mom sailed the library, I don't think she knew about the other entrance. Or that Edie had a key to it. That thing you're afraid of isn't going to end when you leave the house. Edith has a right to know these stories. My children are dead because of your story! History of the Finches. 
dear Edith, there's so many stories I wish I could tell you, but there's only time for one. This is about what happened on the night you were born. Edith, what are you doing in here? It's mine. Edith! Mom, you're gonna rip it! Let go! Her up, but she was already gone. What? She wasn't dead? My mom didn't like to talk about it. But she started getting sick a lot. The rest happened pretty quickly. Poor woman! And then I was alone. The last finch left alive. Until I found out about you. I'm still not sure what to tell you about all this. If we lived forever, maybe we'd have time to understand things. But as it is, I think the best we can do is try to open our eyes. And appreciate how strange and brief all of this is. Okay. Oh, we are being this born. This journal was supposed to be for you. But now I hope you'll never see it. I just want to meet you and tell you all these stories myself. Ah, okay. I was like... I guess if you're reading this now, things didn't work out that way. What? This is where your story begins. I'm sorry I won't be there to see it. It's a lot to ask, but I don't want you to be sad that I'm gone. I want you to be amazed that any of us ever had a chance to be here at all. Good luck. What the fuck? I don't think that kid has long to live anyway. I'm gonna find whoever suggested me this game. I'm gonna punch them in the face. Yeah, I guess I just wanted a little happiness in it. After all that darkness. No, I, I do not ever want to replay a story. So in the end, Eddie is the grand grandmother that was married to Sven. Kelvin and Sam were twins. Sam had a chance to marry with Kay, give birth to our mother Dawn, Gus and Gregory, which Gus and Gregory passed away. Sanjay was our father who died in India. Lewis, Milton, and Edith, which they all died. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you want to be updated when I upload a video, please make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! It's not a bad game, it's just a sad game, there is a difference.